is fun. Okay, this is good. Okay. Hello, my name is Alora, and I am a sophomore at Lincoln East. I like your old stuff. Thank you. Um, <laughs> this uh, is my poem, Super Continental. I loved you in the beginning. In the enthralling time of the Cambrian with the first sea creatures sifting through the sand, the evolutionary boom was down in the depths where the deep blue green of the water reminded me of your eyes and the movement of the currents could pass for religion, bug-brained religion, based on pressure and blurred beauty through eyes that could only see shapes. Geologic time moved slowly through the ages. Slow like the breaking up of the supercontinent, we were pulled apart in time. I loved you before this great extinction, living on the riverside with the first amphibians and the hope that we would last forever. Science, you have abandoned me. You left me here in the wrong time. We were too out of place with the mammals. Please, don't call me a reptile. I loved you in the flirtatious Cretaceous. When you taught me how to pronounce Pachycephalosaurus, you read me dinosaur jokes off the back of a popsicle stick. What do you call a blind T-Rex? A do you think he saw us? <laughs> I shouldn't have taken jokes for granted. Did the dinosaurs take their time for granted as I did? Did they look up at the fire in the sky and feel remorse? Did their dinosaur hearts break as mine did when the ash covered all that was good? And the carbon dioxide brought nothing from the skies but cyanide rain, poison in the rivers. I was the barren landscape pocked with craters four billion before Christ. Primordial chicken soup couldn't cure me or that red sickness, the sickness of self-criticality. I wasn't good enough. I regret nothing more than the past 3.5 billion years of life on this planet and everything I said that made you leave. I paid the price in time, lost time with you who decided to go back to Jurassic. You went Smithsonian and I stayed small town off the Turnpike Museum of Natural History. You needed to go back 65 million years ago and find yourself with the dinosaurs and not with me. In the void of after, of the empty space where there used to be you, I'm in this ice age now. I can't find you in the cold. <laughs>